boxing from Home Depot. <laughs> so, can you guess what I'm making? Let's see here. We got a couple valves, pipe fittings, pressure gauge, two one-way check valves, couple of unions, reducer, some T's, uh, what else we got in here, got a bunch of these guys, three quarter inch by three quarter inch threaded. What else we got? Uh, another reducer. That's a, a one inch by half, and this is a three quarter by half. Another three quarter by three quarter. Another three quarter by three quarter threaded, and some of these things. You don't get to see what these are for yet. These are surprises. Those are surprises. And a fitting for the valve. What are we making? You don't know yet. This will probably be done in a couple parts because there's just not enough time in the day to do everything at once. So what I'm making is a ramp pump to pull water off of our creek. Yes, that's right, finally, water off the creek. And we got our uh, water tank the other day, we put the valve for the water tank together this morning, and so now we're gonna try a ram pump. And um, don't use this as a how-to, don't ask me questions, because I don't know. I, I, I am using, literally, put the ram pump together Clemson University put together a PDF on how to do a ram pump and they also have all the specifics for if you do a three quarter inch size what size your uh, drive pipe needs to be or your input pipe and what size your output pipe needs to be and the pressure tank and all that kind of stuff and it goes I think all the way up to three inch so plenty of sizes to do I'm I chose to do a three quarter inch ram pump just because our flow of the creek I want to be able to capture water for a longer period of time because like like you know it's, it's seasonal so we just want to be able to capture water for a longer period of time I honestly I thought about going with a half inch but that's just just kind of small for me um, we only need to lift it from the tank down to the creek 56 feet over 400 linear feet as a crow flies so the three quarter inch should work fine for this according to the figures from Clemson so anyway who really turned me on to ram pumps was Wrangler start I started researching it this was years ago and then I came across uh, Land a house and land a house. He does all kinds of stuff on uh, on ram pumps. But Wrangler Star was really gave me my first experience or whatever to the ram pump. So we're gonna get started putting it together and enjoy it.
sweet. It's done. It's built. So I just need to put the, can you see that? I just need to put the air chamber on here. I forgot to get the inner tube and hindsight being 2020, I should have threaded this on instead of glued it. Threaded this on instead of glued it. So I'm going to fix that, but we're good. So water's going to come in from over here. Activate the, the pump and come out this come out this side up the hill so when we get to that point we'll show you what's going on but so the links for lend a house wrangler star clemson university where the ram pump stuff is will all be in the description along with our parts list will be in the description what we got from home depot okay cool okay good bye see ya